friends. Today we're going to be making a super easy recipe. It's called Sweet Baby Ray's Crock-Pot Chicken. Crock-Pot Chicken. Say that three times really fast. <laughs> okay, and this recipe is from um, a preacher's wife that we know um, very well for years, and she made a cookbook. And it's called Marilyn's Recipe Collections, and it's um, celebrating 60 years of camp meeting. She usually is one of the main cooks at camp meetings, and she just cooks awesome everything she's ever made of. We've always loved, and this cookbook is wonderful. And so this is from that, and it's super easy. Um, all we're gonna do is we're going to take, let me move you down so you can see what I'm doing here. We're gonna take four chicken breasts, and I like to cut them in strips, just like you would if you were going to um, fry chicken tenders. And you just do it like that. Cut them up, and we're you're just going to place them right here in your crock pot. I've already got my crock pot on. We're just going to lay them in there. And you, uh, these are the really big ones from Walmart. And so what I do is I cut them in half um, this way, and then I do the strips, okay? So it's gonna make about 12, 12 strips. So that's probably the hardest part of the whole recipe is cutting this chicken up, which that is not hard, is it? Not at all. So we're gonna place that in the crock pot just like that. Let me rinse my hand real quick. Get that chicken off. Okay. And then we're going to take um, some Sweet Baby Ray's. And you, they have all different flavors of uh, Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce. You know us, if you've been watching us any amount of time, you know we like spicy. <laughs> so we got the sweet and spicy, but they have hickory, they have, they just have uh, just any, any kind of a flavor you can imagine. And you just take one bottle, and I got the small bottle, it's a, an 18 ounce. And we're just gonna put it in our bowl. Make sure you get it all out. Okay. All right, I think that's about all I'm gonna get out. I'll put it upside down just for a minute. Okay, and then we're gonna do one fourth cup of um, brown sugar. One fourth cup. You know to always pack your brown sugar when you're when you're doing that, okay? You wanna make sure you get enough. Okay, so one fourth cup of brown sugar. Let me rinse my hand again, I got sauce on it. <laughs> okay, and then we're going to do one fourth cup of vinegar, and I just got the regular vinegar. One fourth cup. I'm one of those weird ones that think vinegar smells good. Most people don't. I like it. Okay. And then we're gonna do one teaspoon of garlic powder. And also one teaspoon of these crushed red peppers. Kind of like you would uh, put on your pizza if you're at Pizza Hut. They have those at the table. One teaspoon of them. If you don't like spicy, you can leave that out. If you know us, we're going to like it. We'll see if we get any more in here. Yeah, a couple more spurts, squirts. All right, that's it. We're going to mix it up, and we're going to pour it on top of our chicken. And then we're gonna put it on, um, excuse me, we're gonna put it on low for about four or five hours. If you're in a hurry, you can put it on high for about three or four, okay? 
Now I would probably, if you're gonna put it on high, I would probably stir it just every little once in a while, but not, not you don't wanna open it too much. All right, see me pouring this in here? And that is it. Isn't that easy? Put it on before you go to work and it'll be ready when you get home. I put it on before you go to church. La la. It's done. All right. We'll be back later on when it's done and we'll give it a test. Taste test. Thank you, Lord, for this day, for this food you've given to us. Bless it to our bodies. Uh, thank you for giving us another year with Christopher. Lord, help us uh, help him to be blessed and serve you. Also, Lord, pray for the, our friends and family that are in the hospitals with being sick with COVID. Help them recover in Jesus' name. Very good. It's got a, like a sweet, I guess a sweet barbecue. Kind of what it reminds me of. It's pretty juicy.